do it. The hell? And on my birthday, too! Like I'm not already late enough! Gross! Stupid! I'm dead, douchebags! This is so irritating! Are you okay, Juliet? Yes, I... Are you? I, uh... I, uh... One bit me. Just a little bit. I, I don't know what that means. What does it mean? Huh? Oh, no. It can't be. I feel it in me. I'm gonna become one, huh? <laughs> I... Well, fuck! I'm screwing up your birthday, aren't I? I'm sorry, Juliet. I... I don't want to fuck up your birthday. My birthday? Don't worry about that. That's the dumbest thing ever. Uh, 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 listen, uh, I know it's stupid. We just started getting serious, but... Uh, I wanted you to know. I know I've never said it or anything, but I... I, I kind of sort of... You know... Love you. I love you. Oh. <laughs> Nick. <laughs> no. There's something we can try. It's the only chance we have uh, to save you. Julia? What the fuck? I love you too, baby. Uh, 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 uh. Oh. Julia? What? Am I okay? Uh, yeah. Basically. I feel okay. I feel good. Julia, I'm not a zombie. <laughs> not at all. What? Oh, no. Uh, 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 Nick, uh, I had to. Oh, God. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Where's my fucking body? Oh, fuck! Don't get mad! I don't know what to do! How am I still alive? How am I still talking without a fucking thorax? I performed, uh, a magical ritual on your head. It was really hard. And I don't mean to be a jerk, but I think maybe just a little bit of appreciation is in order. If I didn't chop off your head, the venom would have totally seeped into your brain and turned you into a zombie. Juliet? How? How do you know how to perform a magical ritual on my decapitated head? Um... Well, uh... Um? There's some stuff I didn't tell you before, okay? I didn't want you to think I was weird. I'm kind of, sort of... I... What? Uh, uh Juliet? 
don't know how to say it exactly. Zombies! Zombies! Come I and know. kill us now! I'm a zombie hunter! What? Ah! Ah! Oh! Fuck! Huh? Ah! Huh? Ah! Ah! Don't hate me! Sensei! Ha! Ah, Juliet! One moment, please. Uh, Juliet, it looks like you've really gotten ahead in life. <laughs> My teacher, Morikawa Sensei, is the most amazing veteran zombie hunter ever. Oh. Ah, correct. I have studied the zomboid sciences for 40 years. <laughs> Listen, both of you! The school is in dire trouble. My research tells me that something has gone wrong on a cosmic scale. That's a massive bummer. That completely sucks. Let me show you. The universe is composed of three dimensions. The land beyond words, the rotten world, and our dimension, Earth. There are dimensional walls between each. Using a combination of brack magic and explosive, someone cracked the wall between Earth and rotten world. And the gases of Rotten World seeped into our world. Your friends and fellow students inhaled these gases, which transformed them into the undead. Well, whoever did this could be trying to open a permanent gate between here and Rotten World, which would be catastrophic. Unfortunately, once they have become zombies, there is no return. All we can do is clean up the school, kill the undead, and stop the bomber. That is our mission. The bomber is either in the cafeteria downstairs or the courtyard. You destroy the zombies in the cafeteria. I shall look in the courtyard. I'm counting on you both. Kill the motherfuckers! Yes, Sensei. Magna Genocide, baby! <laughs> hey! I recognize that guy! He went to school with us! He's the one! Planning to open the gate between here and Rotten World! I have to stop him! <laughs> oh man, there's nothing more hysterical to me than watching this world burn! This world, this government, this society made my life a hell! Well, now everyone is gonna know a life of hell! Forever! <laughs> Why did you do this to my school? What, you didn't have time to clean out your locker, Juliet? Hey! Leave her alone! Wait till I get my hands on you, dude! Uh, uh, I mean, uh... Malicious lords, I invoke your dark forces in declaring myself God of this realm. As the pawn is present, may your ritual commence, and may the dark purveyors appear, now! Bingham Kelly's West, Lingori Yellum Tobal, Ellie Moraform Totum Cav, Bingham Kelly Swash. No! Sensei! This world makes me want to puke. You're the one who called us here? <laughs> yeah, that's right. I'm your new master. And I demand you initiate the fawn into the ritual and rot every living thing in the school along the way. <laughs> I did it. All right. 
guys. Time for you to rot this entire school and everyone in it. <laughs> How could you do this to Sensei Morikawa? <laughs> At dickhead, let the ritual commence. <laughs> Let's play. Piss <laughs> off! <laughs> oh, hell. <sighs> talking about you think that hurts me I just jizzed a little <laughs> Mr. Morikawa! Sensei! <laughs> you managed to purify one of the dark purveyors. Yes. <laughs> Look at this. Zed was only the weakest of the dark purveyors. But the other four are here, rotting the school. <laughs> By now, they've probably transformed all your fellow students into undead. The school is probably filled with zombies. Sensei! Mr. Morikawa. Juliet and Nick, I have faith you can stop them. All humans must die, as I must now do. I have this for you, Juliet. Happy birthday, Juliet. You were always my favorite pupil. Sensei!
Now that's a sweet ride. Julia, I'm not sure I can do this, just being ahead. But there's a lot of cool things about being ahead. First of all, I can put you in a bag and sneak you into movies for free. All right, that hardly makes up for... Carpal tunnel syndrome? You're immune. And it's totally cool. I'm like the only girl with a decapitated head for a boyfriend. I don't want to be a fashion accessory, Juliet. This is my life. I... Is that rain? Uh-oh. Ship is not a good thing. Another dark purveyor. Oh, oh my gosh. That's my big sister, Cordelia. Who? My big sister, Cordelia. She's a zombie hunter, too. Really? Hey! Cordelia! Can you hear me? Hey! What's up, Julia? Cordelia! What's up? See you in a few! Right now, I'm gonna go kick some zombie ass! Oh yeah! I almost forgot! Happy birthday! Can't hear you! God, I'm happy you don't have a bladder. Otherwise, I'd be pissing myself right now. <laughs> nice jump! Oh, I can't wait for you to shoot the fuck out of stuff with this! Cordelia is like the best big sister ever! Chainsaw, Chainsaw Blaster! blaster. Cordelia! What? Juliet! There's something on you! No, Cordelia! That's just my boyfriend, Nick! Oh, hey, Cordelia! Uh, how's it going? Hey, he's cute. Thanks! Ouch! The whole no body thing is cool. I wouldn't have to worry about gaining weight. <laughs> Food would just fall out of my neck. <gasps> OMG! Then I wouldn't be as gross and fat as I am now. I don't want chewed food falling out of my neck. That's disgusting. <laughs> bye bye, Scranny! Onward to further victory! Juliet, execute maneuver 54 B. Right. One. Sure. 
Let's show her the Viking way! Ha 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 ha! Got a lot of gall, little girl. This is... it's some sort of farm. I bet any minute another one of those stupid dark purveyors is gonna show up totally bumming our worlds. Don't you think, Nick? 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 Where are you? Right here, Juliet. What happened? I saved you! I was feeling so ineffective, just being ahead and all. I thought it would be better to just go for the gusto, <laughs> you know, get undead the whole deal. <laughs> no! How can this be happening? Let me guess, she's also a freaking zombie hunter? Hey, Juliet, I came to save you! Something's wrong with this bus! Oh, it's really irritating! Is that a new purse? Wait, it's your boyfriend! He's a decapitated head? Fuck me! That's the coolest thing ever! Ah, I almost hit a bird! Look out! Uh, hi, Roslyn! Shit! Sorry, it's not my fault! This bus is fucked up! <laughs> Rosalind, this is Nick. Wow, it's cool. What does the bottom of it look like? Can you see the spine sticking out? Yuck! Awesome! It makes me throw up! Oh, uh, yeah! Nice meeting you, too! Ah, it talks! Ah, it scares me! And I love it! Your family's kind of uh, energetic, huh? Do you smell that? Ugh. Something fishy is going on. No, no way. This is all totally normal. Ah! The brakes aren't working! No! Ah! <laughs> ah! Hey guys, don't worry! I'm cool! I've got it all under control! Shit! This doesn't seem right. I guess we should follow that bus, huh? Wow, Rosalind must have seen this on my Amazon wish list. Nick Popper! I can shoot your head with this. What? Hurry, Juliet, get in! Rosalind! I was worried about you. Are you okay? Yeah, I guess. This stupid bus broke down, but I fixed it. Hey, Rosalind. Nice meeting you up close. Uh, hmm? 
How did you fix the bus, Rosalind? Just last week, you had to take your car to the shop because you didn't know cars needed oil. How could you know how to... <laughs> Rosalind, uh, where are we going? <laughs> Rosalind? Hey. <laughs> You're great! Where the hell are you? <laughs> oh, sister Juliet and brother Nick. Let's travel to the land beyond the doors of perception. Uh -huh. <laughs> Step outside the boundaries of your mind. Lose yourself in the eternal, collective unconscious. <laughs> and rot. Listen, lady, why don't you try using some deodorant? Because honestly, you smell like shit. This one was just as insolent. <laughs> Rosalind! Now, open your heart. <laughs> And let my music guide you <laughs> into the world of everlasting peace <laughs> and rot <laughs> and hell. Truths become... There's like four of her! Is this for real? Choke on your Birkenstocks, you psilocybin munching moron! Heavy. He's out. Way out. Yes, <laughs> me to reggae from the barrio. Go out. Whoa, we've been here the whole time. Rosalind? She's not here. Hey there, Juliet. Are you ready to boogie woogie? <laughs> Who is this? The one you ain't gonna level up on. Why are you pretending to be Stephen Hawking? I got the freaky little super freak right here. Get your hands off of me, you zombie pedo! Juliet, don't worry about me, I- If you want your sister back, baby, you need to win a game with me. Make your way to the Fauci Fun Center. <laughs> I can't wait to party with your crew like it's 1983. It's a trap, Juliet. We can't just rush in there alone. We don't have any other choice, Nick. Who's gonna help us? Hey, baby. Daddy! Mr. Starling? I'm worried about Rosalind. 
Well, that girl knows trouble like apple knows pie. Uh, excuse me. Boy, you be careful now about where you're touching my daughter. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh... <laughs> we gotta be careful. This Rosalind situation, so she don't get hurt. So, I, uh, guess the two of you haven't been formally introduced. Dad, this is... Nick, I know. You told me all about it. Failed to mention the, uh... Disability. It's kind of a new thing, sir. I... You seem like a fine person, but whatever dude Juliet ends up with is gonna be part of the family business. What are you gonna do? Throw magic stars at chupacabras with your tongue? Maybe, Dad. Nick's tongue is very limber. And how do you know that? She doesn't. She doesn't know that at all, sir. She has no idea if my tongue is limber. <laughs> <laughs> We're here. What the hell kind of place is this? It's the Fulci Fun Center, Dad, where all the kids from San Romero hang out after school. Look at this. I'll head into the building at the entrance, all right? Daddy, you go around and sneak in from the back. I'll act as a decoy, drawing all the zombies' attention towards me, while you go up to the roof where Rosalind should be. Uh, Juliet, you just made yourself a decoy. Dad, uh, what's wrong? My little girl is a tactical genius. Your mom and me got a little something for your special day. Happy birthday, baby. Thanks, Daddy. All right, I'm off. Good luck, sir. You're gonna do awesome, I'm sure of it. Stop sucking up, son. And don't think I forgot that tongue stuff, neither. You best watch what you do with my little girl when you're hiding in the shadows. Yes, sir. Okay, sir. I think he really liked you. You're the one from the phone. Give me back my sister. What's the matter, baby? Didn't you like our phone S E X X X? Hmm. That's a pity. Um, hmm. What do I think? Dude, give us Rosalind now. And quit making fun of Stephen Hawking. He's a great man, you perv. I'm the pervert? You the one with a head hanging from your hip. Ah. Uh. I already told you, girlie. If you want to win your sister back, you have to play the game. <laughs> you trusted what I said? <laughs> I'm a mother freaking zombie. Drop the chainsaw now, ho. Hey, baby. Fuck me. Go ahead, Looks like you're out of coins. 
weird voice guy. Mayus Vita Reggae Protosario. around over there what me he's distracting me dad Whoa. <laughs> all right you do you girls find work it seems there's only one of these dark purveyors left so here's what we're gonna do Juliet you attack from the front I'll take out the bastards from here Cordelia you head this way and Rosalind here together we should be able to find this last bastard got it Yes, Daddy. Yep. Rosalind! Check it out! I gave it a makeover! I am not an it. Son, if you don't quit acting like a fruit, I'm gonna stick you in the juicer. Now, come on. I can't take this anymore, Juliet. I'm just slowing you down. Just leave me in a trash can, okay? Or a mailbox or something, because I don't want to go any further. I'm not going without you. I love you. No, you don't. You just think it looks cool to have a boyfriend who's a decapitated head. What about what I want? But what if the zombies find you? They love human face. It's their favorite part. Uh, that's a risk I'm willing to take. Cause living like this sucks anyway. <laughs> no! No? You can't just take me if I don't want to... Yes, I can. Because I love you so much! Let's get moving! Yeah! Kick some ass! Ooh, yeah. Come on, girl! Yeah. Let's kick some ass! Let's go! Kill me already! Juliet! I hope you work things out with your boyfriend! I think we could if he stopped being a jerk! Hey! I'm the one who's being kidnapped! I'll cover you until I'm out of ammo! Go! Juliet! I see it! Hold on to something! Here! Make sure you're protected from anything that gets in your way. Well, here I go. Good luck to both of them. Nick, you may not be the guy I'd pick for my daughter, but you're obviously the guy she'd pick for herself. She's always been a hell of a lot smarter than me. Uh, thanks. This is incredible. Juliet, you actually made it. Fantastic. You! How could you do this? To our school! To the people we loved! What? Juliet! <laughs> Oh, 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 Juliet. I've been getting so lonely since you've been wasting all my dark purveyors. Poor Lewis here is the only one left. And there's about to be none. Ah, cocky little whore. I like that. Bring it on, douchebag. I'm gonna F you up. I love your passion, babe. Looks like we can make beautiful death together! <laughs> I've got a feeling when I see...
start playing, you're just gonna die! Rock and roll is here to stay, you're not! the bike. Now's your chance to finish him. Knock that ass. All right, Chicky. Keep up now. We gonna fly. You ready? Now let's go to the depths of hell! <laughs> Elephant rock! Stop to keep you waiting. <laughs> Fantastic work, Juliet. You've done everything just as I hoped you would. Start to finish. Thanks for your cooperation. Now the real deal is fulfilled. <laughs> what? What are you talking about? You incredibly hot idiot. I told you. For the gates of hell to open, a ritual must be enacted. And you were part of it all along. I set this whole thing up, you fools! <laughs> now the ceremony has been completed! A pawn, you, had to sacrifice five pre-selected zombies, and they must utter the sacred words at the point of their deaths. Meus vita reggae pro nefario coepto. Why? Why are you doing all of this? Because you're just like everyone else! You pretended to be different, but you're not! What? Me? Yes! Juliet, you! Bitch! Everything. This school, this world, deserves to be destroyed. It rejected me. It ridiculed me. So I'll make this rotten world even more rotten. Rot away. Rot away. Rot. 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 So fuck all of you. Your eternal screams of horror will be my pop music! Zombie of zombies, Killabilly. Yesterday, I stubbed my toe. I was like, this is the worst day ever. Yeah, not quite. This isn't possible! This isn't 
impossible! He's too strong! Do it! Now! Jump on his body! Did you see the way that dude's head back there splattered all over everything? If I had put you in a mailbox, you would have missed that! Juliet, can you hear me? Listen carefully as our connection is tenuous. You must do as I say. Okay. You're making good progress. A path will open for you if you move ahead, through his mouth and into his body. Well, I'm pretty good at keeping guys out of my body. Never tried getting inside of someone else's. what he did because he trusted you. Show him he was right to believe in you. Okay, Nick. Let's get this over with. Listen carefully. This is your final lesson. Killer Billy is a mountain of tainted flesh, held together by evil spirits. You have to send a signal from its core, commanding it to self-destruct. Once the body is destroyed, all of the captured souls will be sent back to Rotten World. Take control of his core, and make him destroy himself. How? By detonating a Nick bomb. A what? Like you have throughout this battle, you must connect Nick's head to Swan's body. But what will happen to Nick? I am so sorry. As Nick would die. But perhaps... Sensei? I can't hear you! Juliet, there's a reason I'm here. There's a plan greater than all of us. But it's time to say goodbye. Put me there and make the bomb. What? 
You need to put me on Swan's body. It's the only way to stop him. Nick, no! He said you'll die! Juliet, it's okay. I feel strong for the first time in my life. I feel lucky to have been on this journey with you and your family. I feel like a zombie hunter. I can't, Nick. I don't want to be without you. I know, baby. But sometimes there are more important things than what we want in life. <laughs> Nick. <laughs> The Mad Feast has come to an end. You have truly been a hero. The Glorious Ones have chosen to bless you with a reward. But unfortunately, in the shuffling of this death and that death, this body and that, there was a small mix-up. A, a, a mix-up? I will be watching you from above. So please, in my memory, have Juliet do plenty of cartwheels while wearing those little white panties with the teddy bear. <laughs> Juliet? The mix-up. I've got Morikawa's body. Well, uh, what the hell, I guess. Hey, face suckers! Up here! Daddy, you're okay! Yep. I think I lost a testy in the blast, but what the hell, you only need one. Looking great, sir! We best hurry. Your mama's gonna be worried. Daddy, don't you think you should go to the hospital? Not necessary. I used a staple gun up there to put the old stroke back together again. I'm a new man! That's completely horrifying. You know what? This has really been the best birthday ever. <laughs> 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 Mom, I'm home! Mama, your lover boy is back. Everyone, where were you? You were supposed to be home hours ago. Mom, I have someone I want you to meet. Mrs. Starling, hi, I'm Nick. Oh, you're Juliet's friend. Mom, what's wrong? Ju Juliet? everyone. <laughs> Time for dinner. Holy mother! Oh! And by dinner, 